Hey Growler Nation, thanks for joining us today. My name is Ben, and today we're gonna to be talking about the American Session IPA gravel bike. Uh, it's a very versatile bike, super fun, uh, can take many forms, whether it's commuting or gravel racing or just off-road adventures, it can really be whatever you wanna make it. Uh, so you can run two different wheel sizes on this bike. It's very common to have two different wheel setups. You know, one setup would, might have a skinnier, faster rolling slick tire for the road, and then your off-road wheel set would be a little bit wider and some more knobby tread on there. We have huge tire clearance on this frame. You can run Road Plus 650B by 48C tires, which come standard if you choose that option. The alternative is a 700 by 43, and those are both gonna be Gravel King SK tires. Really good all around tire. We have 7005 aluminum tubing on this frame, just like our other aluminum bikes that are made here in the USA. So the 7005 aluminum is a really high-end tube set. It's lightweight, it's strong, and it's nice and stiff, so it's a really efficient pedaling platform. Pair that with a nice high volume tubeless tire and a carbon fork, and it gives you really great ride compliance as well. We have internally routed hydraulic disc brakes on this bike. Uh, as well as internal dropper routing, which we do have here. Nice wide handlebars, gives you a very comfortable ergonomic feel with a flared handlebar. It also is a nice upright, more endurance-based geometry than the traditional road racing bike. So it's a bike you're gonna be very comfortable on, you can ride for a long time, and uh, has a little bit longer wheelbase, which makes it more stable at high speeds. So we have a T47 threaded bottom bracket on this frame. It's a good standard. Uh, it allows you to use any spindle diameter that you want and anything that's available on the market today, whether it's 30 millimeter, dub, or traditional Shimano 24. Uh, but it's easy to work on at home. It's, a, it's not something you're gonna have to own a lot of extra tools to, to work on by yourself. We use a 44 millimeter head tube that is also has a pressed in aluminum cups. So it's easily serviceable and something you can own for a long time and enjoy. We're running tubeless wheels and tires. Uh, a couple different wheel and tire options, depending on what drivetrain you choose, there is a wheel upgrade available. The Apex build comes with a Shimano hub and a DT Swiss rim, and the, any build above that comes with a Stans No Tubes Crest S1 wheel set. They both have great tubeless interfaces, they're both very durable and, and remarkably lightweight. We run a 1x11 drivetrain on these bikes. It offers a, a large amount of range, but it, I really like the simplicity of the 1x setup as opposed to the 2x. Most people are surprised at how much range you can actually cover with just a 1x setup when they're coming from a 2x drivetrain. There's pros and cons to both types of drivetrain setups. We prefer the 1x for its simplicity, lightweight, and less moving parts. It's just a really great setup for us. So we designed this frame with a nice low standover height and it also allows you to have more clearance for a dropper post, which we have here. This is a 120 dropper on a, on a 61 centimeter frame. Plenty of room to spare. Uh, if you get off road or on any sort of downhill, technical downhill section, it's nice to have that dropper post and lower that saddle, get it out of your way so you can maneuver the bike underneath you very well. So that's it for the American Session IPA. Thanks for joining us today. If you like our video, please give us a like. You can also subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them in the comments below. Thanks again, and we'll see you on the next one.